Hey guys, welcome back. So, oh shit. Hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I have bangers and mash. So this was an idea from my boyfriend actually. So props to him. He actually said, you know, your viewers are primarily American. So why not do a bangers and mash video? So that's what I'm going to do. So I've got some homemade mashed potato. So I've got potatoes, butter, cream, milk. And I have some sausages. These are Cumberland sausages. And I have some onion gravy. So I'm going to do the honours now. And pour it on. Oh, wow. This is amazing. I have a probably... Oh, no. I was going to say I've poured too much. So here it is, guys. Also, guys, do you notice anything different with the camera? I have put a wide lens on the camera. So what do you think? Are we looking a bit different? Is it more kind of homely? Because I wanted to kind of do, I wanted my like mukbangs and videos to be more kind of, I think the wide lens, lens makes it more homely, not homely, but it's kind of more, I think it's a cooler lens. It looks cool because you can see everything around me and it's like, everything's like, do you know what I mean? It look, it's, it's a cooler angle. Everything looks like big around here. So it's, it's amazing. So, guys, I'm going to actually shut up now. So, this is it. Oh, my God. Let's try some mash. So, this is a very big staple dinner um, in England. I don't want it to go on the camera. Oh, God. What's that, guys? Oh, this, this is what I mean. Have a bite, guys. Go on. Mmm. Mm. Wow. Now, this to me is top comfort food. It's just hearty, very British. Mm. Mm, wow. And the onions are slightly crunchy because I like my onions like that. Mmm. I've also got some water. I'm trying to cut out the um, the fizzy stuff now. Because it's just no good for me. Oh, yum. Let's try some sausage in a minute. Hmm? Mmm. This is a sausage. Have you ever had... There's the sausage, guys. Have some sausage. Go on, you know you want to. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. Oh, wow. Sorry, guys, I had a phone call. I always have a phone call when I'm filming. It's so annoying. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So yeah, what do you think of the um, lens? Mm. You know, I've not had mash in absolutely forever. Like, it's just not something I have. Mm. But this is amazing. It really is, guys. So yeah, like I said, bangers, is, bangers and mash is, is sausages in English. Mm. And it's something we call it's a British food for sure. I did see Divine Munchies do it though. She did it completely wrong. It was almost like an insult to English food. She kind of had vegetarian sausages and she had some onions with it. No. This is how it's done. And it's just so comforting and warming. So let me know, guys, if you've ever had this dish. I just thought I'd bring a bit of, like, England to you guys. Mmm. And it's really a healthy dish as well, guys. Hmm. 
So I hope everyone is enjoying their day today. Oh, these onions are so sweet. What do you think of my hair? I really like my hair like this. It it's very sophisticated, I think, and very kind of structured. I feel it's very clean and tidy and out of my, my face so you don't, so you all can't moan and say that. <laughs> it's all in, my hair's in my face. Well, I'm not touching my hair. This is so good. Have some more mash, guys. Go on. I love mash. Mmm. Look at that. In America, you tend to guys, you, you tend to guy him. Um, God, I can't speak. In America, you guys tend to have mashed potato with like KFC and biscuits and gravy. We don't have biscuits and gravy here, but it would be nice. I've never had a biscuit. What is a biscuit? Is it like a um, a scone? What is it? It's just so weird to me. People have it with like honey. I don't know if Chris has made a biscuit before. Hmm. It's crazy though, because I don't know. Mmm. Mmm. Sugar. So, guys, I've just filmed an amazing video. I won't tell you about the success surprise. And I'm just so honoured and grateful that I'm, I have so many amazing opportunities coming my way. It's crazy. We've hit 8,000 8, subscribers. Mm. And I just couldn't be happier. Oops. It's just a dream of mine that I'm doing this. It really is. One thing though, guys, I, I know I mentioned it in my other video. People's comments are so silly. Someone said, why do you say this is this is so fucking good? It's only water. I don't have to explain everything I do. I don't get it. I'm really starting to bug me, guys. It's just like no one, not no one, because 99.9 .9 of you love uh, lovely, but the odd couple. And I have to stop myself from messaging something because I'm very fiery as a person, but I've had to, I'm having to learn. Now I'm on a platform. I can't just go saying stuff. You know, the eat with Q thing. I wouldn't dream of doing anything like that now because I've got such a big, you know, it's not such a big following, but the bigger of a following you have, <coughs> no matter what, what you say, I know I could, I, you know, I don't want to be a role model. I'm not a role model, but I, I'm, like I've said it, I'm not a role model, but in some way, you kind of are, because young people are watching you and they, you know, they are, I don't know, people, you do kind of get in people's heads sometimes, whether it's good or bad. Mm. I don't know. You like you, know, but but that's that's with everything. Like if I was, if I met someone that I was friends with, you do kind of have the the her her or his influence do kind of seep into you. So without knowing it, you are influencing people, and I want to influence for the good, obviously. And by writing stuff to other people, it doesn't make me look good. I've had to learn that because. I'm a human being and even though my success hasn't been overnight it's been very sudden I 
I'm not saying that I give abuse to people. I don't. I'm saying those off chances where you just feel like, hmm, you know, I can relate to people who act a bit like that on, you know, it's annoying to receive, but I can understand it because say if you're, if you don't know, if you don't agree with something that, like if I don't, I'm not making any sense. If someone is doing something like having to go up something about something trivial, I don't agree with, but if someone's like standing up for what, what they believe in and they say something on, on there and, or, you know, saying that girl's really rude on there and, you know, I'm really upset that you can't really, I don't think I can because I have, I'm setting an example. Do you know what I'm trying to say or does it not make sense? Whatever. Anyway, guys, mm, I've literally here with that. I'm so full. But it's so good, guys. Quite a good chef, aren't I? Do you want to see the gravy, guys? That's the gravy. Let's see. I'm full. I feel like I'm going to burst, actually. So let me know what you think of the wide lens. I haven't put a fit. There's a fisheye one as well. And it's so good. Like, it's really professional. I mean, I'll have to show you, actually, how... Um... So, I hope you've enjoyed this mukbang, guys. It's been amazing. I am literally so full. I feel like I'm going to have to go and have a nap. But I've got so much to do now. I've got to tidy up. That's the aftermath of cooking. It's just tidying up. So what would you like to see from me next? I would love to do a wing stop, but it's in the, it's in London. So if anyone from London wants to send me a wing stop, I'd be really grateful. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching my video. Don't forget there's so much more coming up. I love you all so much and have an amazing day. Bye, guys.